So my love's already there. Last track of the album. Um, I think it's the last track just because I don't think there was any other place we could really put it. Um, it's a super intimate track. It's a, it's a private track about a private moment. It's obviously, you know, in the public space, but um, it's, 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 it's talking about how, you know, somebody's going through something who's very close to you and you can't physically be there. But you want to kind of say, you know, I kind of, the love that I feel for you is already there, just physically, I'm not. And um, I knew this was going to be like a, it's a live take, it's a one take, it's the one time I ever did it. We tried to do it studio style, vocals and pianos and to a click and all, all that stuff. And, and just, I just knew when I was setting it up that that wasn't going to work. So, um, you know, I'm not a piano player. <laughs> Anyone that's seen me live knows that already. So I just, you know, got myself into space, got myself ready to do it, wrote all the lyrics out, knew what I wanted to say, and then just let it flow. And, you know, after listening back to the take, which was the first time I tried it and first time I attempted it, I was like, I could fix that, I could sing that better, but you know, I didn't want to. All the emotion I, I, I could feel and still deliver the track was there. So that was that. Um, and it's a very fragile track. And that's okay. You know, I just think... Um, again, Flood has been trying to get me to explore what my voice can do and what my voice can... and how I can sing and, and, and what I can do with my voice, as opposed to sing songs, play guitar and do gigs, there's more. And this track I think is the latest place in that. Not only did I want to write a very intimate song that was, that was, you know, had a lot, was very emotionally charged, but I also wanted to sing it in a way that was also fragile and emotional. So I had to sing it in a way that I've never sung anything before to get that feeling of, woo, I'm not, I'm not too confident up here either. Um, just to kind of capture that sense of fragility when you're trying to get that much emotion, you know, onto a, onto a take. So, um, yeah, it's a beautiful track. It's quite difficult for me to listen to, but in the past when I've made tracks like this, they've really touched people. So, you know, I hope this one touches people too.